Lee? That you? Shit. I thought you were... gone. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What'd I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's?
Haven't I seen you here before? Got a good memory for faces. We're closed right now. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Whoa, whoa, start again. What is it you want to do? Concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Sus, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Listen, have you seen Evelyn? I need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. You just answer my question. I'm trying to find Evelyn. That's all you need to know. Better start looking then. Black. Listen, if you don't know where she is, just tell me. I don't have time for verbal volleyball. Do you know or not? All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find clouds. Look there. And where's clouds? Sig case on my desk's got the address. Just take it and go. Mega Tower. Luxurious. regular there or drone forget Evelyn admit it this is about Judy's virtues isn't it good shit if I say so myself hey look Name's V. And what? No, pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me.
long time. Kaku Akata, the Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find the moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts. You did quite well. You and that. Until then. Take a bite. Got any doorbuster deals on Yukatas? Please, please. Shop at a big pleasure. Iroshaimase!
way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What if I miss this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. I think Judy's lying. Why? Little something called intuition fee. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky rather go with sky i couldn't have chosen better myself now for the payment and you'll venture into the clouds Not here to pay and play. Just want some info. Ah, unfortunately, that we do not sell. Should you change your mind, come back. All right, I changed my mind. I'll pay. Temptation is often too strong to resist. Please jack in. There you go. The payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Looking for Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. That it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me.
Only two willing to spread their legs for you. We hope you enjoy your Sad. stay. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Guess that makes you a real Hi, dude. Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be Vincent. Welp, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Think you know me well? Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. I snuffed it once, and I'm gonna do it all over again. Got no idea how to stop it. There. Happy? You're scared, because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look... Pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? The people I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's where I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction the end but as a change that thought alone could save your life I think I might just be afraid so I imagine these things to distract myself from the thought of the void, because that's about what greeted me before. Fear is your most effective weapon in the fight against death. So what now? Now, you find out what it is you need to do. Which is, you're gonna tell me? How do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, 
Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. Thanks, uh... For all this. Jeez. Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. Samurai. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake. Ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you, your Eddies and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. All right, fine. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the shit. First, tell me what you know about Evelyn. Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth two, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Oh, no shortage of wise assets. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. I need to piss first. Ugh. Better keep this short and sweet. Too. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh, I don't have your details. Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? 
She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kinda like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. No clients allowed in here. Be a chum and close the door on your way out, would you? As you can see, I'm... Very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. You look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. You've got info, I've got eddies. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddies will buy you a horse here, not snitches. I look like either of those to you. Told you what you look like. Don't tell me you weren't listening. Surely a reasonable man like yourself wouldn't mistake a donation for a bribe. Real pleasure chatting. But just where exactly do you see this going? Right, we're done here. And I'll be sure to let your bosses know how you treat your customers. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. First off, I highly fucking doubt you know who my boss is. If you did, you wouldn't be calling her my bosses. And on second thought, think I'll take you to my car now. 
Just to see the look on her face when you tell her whatever it is you make up on the way. She hates lying assholes as much as I do. But we all deserve a laugh, don't we? If I were you, I'd run the cash angle. It's practically written on his face. F-R-A-U-D. I know you've been skimming off this place's till. How much you clep already? What the fuck are you talking about? Talking about the eddies you skim from Cloud's accounts on a weekly basis. Not skimming anything, I'd have to be a fool. Doesn't matter. I'm just curious what the Tiger Claw leadership is gonna think once they find out. Won't think anything because it ain't fucking true. I work with the dolls. Cloud's account's got shit to do with me. You sneaky little shit. Kudos to you for hatching this one. This conversation's starting to bore me. Humor me, will ya? This particular piece of ass. Out of all of them. Why? She wasn't even that good. She was hot. I'll give you that. But for all the delusions of grandeur, she was nothing more than a basic whore. And like all basic whores, she got what was coming. As will you. You're the king of fuck-ups. You're not helping. Now what? Hell, why don't you just scan the truth from his gray, lifeless eyes? Or scour his cup? That just might work. Sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. Nice work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps?
think Fingers got her. I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. <laughs> of course you do. You'd have loved to have dropped the H-bomb on this place. No need to go so OTT. I've got other methods. One thing's for sure, though. Klaus won't forget this. Welcome to the N54 News World Report. I'm Jillian Jordan. Scientists from Biodyne Systems have announced a breakthrough in the fight against multiple sclerosis. MS is one of the few diseases that cannot be cured by replacing the affected tissue with implant technology. But the experts at Biodyne have... <laughs> you had a plan. You tried. It fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find help. For the second consecutive week, the last fell inferno in the remnants of Atlantic City continues to rage on.